Hi, John Paranchi here with your August local property update. July saw many potential buyers and sellers taking a well-deserved overseas break, flooding social media with photos from Europe. Now that most holiday makers are back, we've seen a surge in both seller and buyer inquiries. Here are a selection of sales for the past 30 days. 21 Isla Street, Glazeville for 2,620,000, which sold to a young family from North Ryde. Three Chevalier Crescent, Hunters Hill, which sold for just over $14 million to a family moving closer to the city from Dural. Apartment 302 Walsley Road, Dremoyne in the Bianca development, which sold for $9,450,000 to a family downsizing from Hunters Hill. Bianca is developed by award-winning Central Element, is set to be completed by the end of 2025 and is a world-class development in a prime north-facing waterfront location. This is the fourth apartment sold off the plan for over $9 million, highlighting the demand for quality properties in premium locations. We also sold 12 Short Street Glazewell for $4.3 million. This is a suburb record for a duplex. We also have some fantastic listings on the market, which include 166 Princess Street Putney, 77 Western Crescent Glazeville, 196 Princess Street Putney, 5 Mar Street Glazeville, and 156 Charles Street, also in Putney. For more details about our current listings or recent sales, please visit mcgrath.com.au. Now, if you're looking for a waterfront property, Keep an eye out for these upcoming listings. We have 68A Wharf Road, Glazeville coming, along with 74 and also 78 Champion Road in Tennyson Point. The overall market remains steady with CoreLogic reporting a modest 0.3% increase in Sydney property values in July, bringing the 12-month increase to 5.6%. Locally in Glazeville, Tennyson Point and Putney, there were 18 auctions scheduled last month, with 11 selling at or before auction. This resulted in a 61% clearance rate, which aligns with the Sydney average. My clearance rate this year is 90%. Looking ahead to spring, I anticipate an influx of properties to hit the market, which may result in an oversupply, potentially affecting auction clearance rates. Spring, school holidays and Christmas are just around the corner. So if you are considering this year, timing is critical with so many variables that can influence your outcome. To discuss the best timing for you and your property, get in touch using the following details. This month, we also welcomed Antonius Canis to our team. Antonius brings over 20 years of real estate experience. As an Inner West local, he will be looking after our clients in Abbotsford, Warimba, Chiswick, and Russell Lee. He'll be joining the formidable brother and sister team of Matthew and Claire Ward, cementing our commitment to our Inner West clients. Welcome, Antonius. Finally, I've just released my digital end of financial year report for Glazeville, Tennis and Point and Putney. The report covers average sale prices, sales volume, the top sales and trends for each suburb and compares it to the previous 12 months. If you'd like to see how your suburb fared this year, get in touch and I'll send you a copy. Thanks so much for tuning in. Look forward to seeing you next month. <music>